You have to remember one thing I think is very important, that the white Jews that we see today have no bloodline connection with, with the Jews of the biblical period. They were converted to Judaism in Europe and in, 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 uh, in Russia. They were converted and have no bloodline connection with the black Jews who make up the biblical Israel that the Bible writes about and of which Jesus was a part. Well, what happened to the black Jews? The black Jews are still in existence. They're black Jews in America. They're black Jews all over Africa. They're black Jews in Palestine. They're black Jews everywhere. Uh, Diane's daughter complained not, not more than two years ago that black Jews had moved on either side of her house and therefore her property had depreciated in Palestine. Black Jews had depreciated her property. Jews uh, had moved directly from Palestine to India, and the, the community celebrated its uh, 1900th uh, uh, anniversary or something, and they had white Jews who had emigrated from Europe, and black Jews who had originally come from Jerusalem at the fall of uh, uh, Jerusalem, had an un uninterrupted straight line of connection from the fall of Jerusalem to, to India. All over the world there are black Jews, but the, the Zionists, Jews who had been converted to Judaism have taken over the, the, the control of the definition of what Judaism is, as white people do with anything. If they come into it, they take it over and define what it is, as, as you stated in your introductory statement. So we have to remember that white Jews, when you see them on the street, are not the Jews of the biblical period. And that sometimes confuses black people who ought to be black Christian nationalists. One of the things I'm hearing...